Welcome to 24 Hours In, the series where we show you how to pack in an unforgettable day in any city. Today, we're spending 24 hours in Knoxville, Tennessee. It'll be the most memorable, jam-packed day in Knoxville history. All right, it's 7 a.m., I'm barely awake, and I'm going to wander around Market Square to beat the crowds. This spot is usually bustling, but right now, I've got it all to myself. Huh. <sighs> Ooh, a sculpture garden across the street. Gorgeous, gorgeous shapes. Hmm, this must be a sculpture of my ex. Looks like art and culture are alive in Knoxville. It's time to hit up Pete's where I can drink all the diner java I want and get this amazing biscuit sandwich in the process. Even the birds love it. Thanks, Pete. Now that I've had my seven cups of coffee, it's time to hit up Art Market Gallery. Did you know that Knoxville is known as the Maker City? I guess this place is cool if you're looking for fungible art. All that art made me hungry. Whether you're a football fan or not, you'll want to head over to Saloon 16, the Peyton Manning-owned saloon for lunch, where I had the absolute pleasure of sampling something called cheese bings. Now that I need to walk off those cheese bings and prove that I'm the most passionate Vols fan in America, so I'm going to head over to University of Tennessee and try to find all the Smokies I can. That's a Vols mascot. He's a blue tick coon hound. One, two, Three? Okay, that's enough. Let's hit up the mural walk. It has everything. Music-related murals. Murals you can walk on. Murals in alleyways. Ew, what's that smell? Let's head to Lost and Found Records where you can swap your old records for new ones. So many options. Let's see. You literally can't go wrong with a Bill Withers record. Thanks. It's time for a beer at Knox Brew Hub. All the beer is local and you can get a colorful flight with a variety of different beers. Wow, watch that growler spin. I'm getting dizzy. It's dinner time. We have a 6 p.m. reservation at Kaizen, a Japanese-style izakaya pub with art from local tattoo artists and an incredible selection of Japanese whiskey. You know I'm getting the pork belly fried rice. I'd love to stay and sample all the whiskey, but I have to get to the sunset at River Bluff, which has the best view of the Tennessee River in town. What a romantic place to be an accidental third wheel and crash a date. Hey guys, hope it's going well. Time to head back to the city and catch some more spectacular views from 530 Lounge. A cozy outdoor fireplace and a nice cool mule? Side me up. One more place to hit on the bar crawl. It's time for Brother Wolf. Despite being famous for their Negronis, I went in the lemon sorbet spritz direction because I wanted some dessert in my drink. The next logical step after all these amazing cocktails is putting on some communal shoes and trying my luck on the bowling lanes at Maple Hall. Party of one over here. Ooh, and there's Big Scrabble. I may have had a long day, but I still know how to spell Thrillist. Finally, I must lay my head down for a night of slumber. I definitely got my steps in today. My hotel is called The Graduate and is for ride or die Vols fans like myself. It's practically a shrine to Peyton Manning. Good night, Peyton. Good night, Thrillist. You sure know how to make your day in Knoxville count. Oh.